Hi Taurus, how you doing? Let's see what energies we have for you today concerning love. What does the sign of Taurus please need to know concerning love? What does the sign of Taurus need to know please concerning love? Two of Swords. Making decisions. Eight of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Focusing on something. King of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. King of Cups. Somebody reluctant to show their feelings, although they're very well-intentioned and loving. The world. It's a new cycle opening. Queen of Swords. Hmm. You're waiting on a decision. Magician. Ten of Swords. Yeah, somebody's somebody's hurting here. There's endings. Knight of Pentacles. Mm, somebody's holding back. Certain cases being stubborn. Page of Cups. There's a message here. Justice. Wow. Right off the bat, I feel you're trying to decide on something, trying to decide on what to do about a situation that you're in concerning your love life. Trying to look at your alternatives, trying to see which is the best way forward. I'm feeling you you want more information, you want to know something. Yes, there's, there's definitely a closure of feelings here. Somebody's, you're, you're feeling betrayed, backstabbed. I'm getting here, you want to know the truth on how somebody feels about you and the situation. See here, look, you... Queen of Swords, Page of Cups. I'm getting from this, you know, somebody here wants to know the truth about how somebody feels. There's, there's a reluctance here to open up. I feel both of you are kind of closed off your emotions and somebody here is being a little bit stubborn. Kind of they won't budge on their opinion of this. It's as if they're watching and waiting to see how things develop. I'm getting a test of commitment here. I do feel you will get a message though. Yeah, you're trying to find out the truth.
I'm getting kind of, I'm not, I'm, I'm kind of getting, I'm, I don't want to get involved until I, I know the truth about this. For some of you, you've had a message that's put you into thinking mode and you're giving it serious thought. But it, the message wasn't clear. I feel the message was only full of half-truths and you kind of sense this, you intuitively know this and you want them to tell you more. Yeah. Things here didn't kind of go the way you hoped. There hasn't been enough progress, there hasn't been enough communication, there hasn't been enough facts revealed. I'm getting here, you are considering walking away from this. You know, like kind of packing your bags and leaving. Not necessarily physically, but metaphorically. But there's somebody here with closed off emotions. There is the chariot here though, there, there is movement. After such a long, long time of not communicating, and if they did communicate it was very, very short messages, I feel there is some progress here, there is some movement. So one of you is on the move here. can mean travel because we've got the world card here yeah you're coming into a phase of better balance between you two somebody here wants reconciliation with the temperance card Sagittarian energy yeah somebody here wants to talk Yeah. There's an opportunity here coming coming up for the two of you to try and sort this out, get together and you know, just tell each other how you feel. Yes. Magician here, communication opening up. But not forceful communication. Communication, listening as much as talking. You know, willing to take on board each other's opinions on how this situation has gone. Yeah, there's... You're starting to love yourself first, you, you know, put yourself first. Because this situation hasn't gone, you know, how you would hope. You, 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 with regards to love, you feel backed into a corner. So now you're going to start to put yourself first and go after what you want. That's what I'm getting from this. Somebody here doesn't want to emotionally get involved. Not at the moment. Yeah. I feel they're going to communicate with you. After a long stay of being stubborn, holding back, resistance, I feel they suddenly decide out of nowhere to communicate. And I, I, yeah, I'm getting messages here, messages coming in. Yeah, messages of praise.
something like, you know, I'm sorry I haven't communicated. I've had a lot. I've been doing this, been doing that, been doing a lot of thinking, you know. But really, I think you're great. Can we sort of talk? That kind of energy. You know, I really do like you, but nothing. It's, it's kind of not willing to share the emotions, but only willing to let a certain amount show. So I've got the justice card here. Yeah. Transition card. I feel this whole situation is going through a transit period and it could go either way, depending on your situation. I'm talking to a lot of people here and I don't know everybody's details of every personal situation. It's not possible in a general read. But I'm getting this could go two ways. But either way, you'll get your karma. Some of you will choose to end this and stop it dead. And some of you will choose to actually sit down and talk and go forwards with this person. But I am getting a fork in the road. And as I say, depending on each of you, this could go either way. But I'm getting a fork in the road for you, a decision here. Somebody's let go of their feelings a little bit. And it's up to you to decide. That's what I'm getting from this reading. I hope that's helped. The ball's in your court. You're in control of this. I hope that's helped and I hope to see you again soon. Bye for now.